I started here at the Ice House learning about sort of the challenges that businesses were facing to become internationally capable and really what were the practical insights that were helping businesses to grow. And at that point was kind of interested in not only how were we growing New Zealand businesses, but how could we do that for Māori organisations? How could we take those same principles and those same lessons and make them relevant for Māori organisations which have a social context but run businesses, often primary sector businesses? And so presented a proposition to the CEO that, you know, maybe we should consider this. And they backed it. I think entrepreneurship really is about solving problems. And so when you can be really focused around finding problems that people are facing, identifying you know, what, what problems are people really experiencing that I might be able to help with, and then who's interested in paying to solve that problem, once you've found those two things, that's gold. And that's really all you need as an entrepreneur. You don't even need a solution. You just need to really understand the problem and really understand the customer or the person paying to solve that. And then from that, you can learn from them all the things you need in order to be able to create a solution for that. Adding value actually means creating the product that is of most value to the customer. And, and what we're finding in trends around the world around food, particularly in, in premium markets where people have got a lot of money to spend and what they're really caring about is that they, their food is safe, that it's, that it's healthy, that they can guarantee where it's come from and that it's not compromised in terms of its origin. New Zealanders and Māori are really well regarded internationally and often we don't, we're not confident in telling that story. And I think that there's a whole aspirational piece and confidence piece that is really important to unlock amongst our New Zealand community because it's only when we do that that we're really going to capture the value of what we have as a unique story you know, we've, we live in a very remarkable part of the world and that's valuable to people. And people want to be part of that. They want to be part of sharing that story. And so when they can buy a product that comes from here with that story imbued in it, uh, you know, that, there's a lot of value in that.